Hey there everyone, Trenti here, and welcome back to Persona 3 FES. So in the last episode, we maxed out Igus' social link, and now we have every social link maxed, and we can now create uh, a new Persona. So I, I kind of just came here to see what I had before I started, and uh, here's what happened when I entered the Velvet Room before coming here. Oh, hello Igor, uh, what's up? Well, well, what? Yes, I've discovered each of the social links and formed ranked Tennysons with them all. Uh, not... Oh, maybe. Oh, uh, what's this? A cipher like me. Should I have this? Yes, we obtained the cipher's mask. And this will allow us to create uh, Orpheus Telos. So, uh, yeah, we'll be doing that here in a minute. Anyways, uh, let's jump back to now. So, yes, now we can make Orpheus Telos, as I mentioned. And, um, well, before we do that, we kind of have to make Metatron. Uh, I'm not going to worry about registering the Persona right now, because it's just Messiah. <laughs> Which I guess I don't need him anymore, because I have everything, but uh, still. So we're going to need Uriel here. So I guess it's lucky that I fused him. Let's see, we need good old Michael. He was kind of uh, a little bit of a carry for a second there. Now we have to go all the way up to Empress and Lovers. Where are we at? Okay, Lovers. We need Raphael, the best Ninja Turtle. Maybe. I don't even remember which one that is, to be honest. And then we need Gabriel. Not Peter Gabriel. There we go. Gabriel. So now that we have that, let's just go ahead and back out of this. Please, no Crasherino. I thought I was going to. Yes. Mm, interesting combination. Yeah, so we go over to the cross fusion here. Yeah, Metatron. Uh, let's see. I'm weak against Dark. I think... Didn't I have someone who knolls Dark? Null Strike is pretty good. So, uh, yeah, let's just do a little bit of this. Null Strike, Dodge Fire, Null Fear. I mean, the Mind Charge, I'll, I'll take, I guess. Uh, let's see, Null Panic. I'm pretty sure someone had something with Dark. I should have been paying attention a bit more. But maybe not. So yeah, welcome. I'm, I'm sure I've talked about it many times, but uh, welcome to what it's like to fuse personas in Persona 3. This is what you do. And it's terrible. Absolutely terrible. There we go. Repel Dark. Oh, but like this is... This is kind of shit otherwise. I mean, Counter-Strike is fine. I guess Mind Charge for what? I have nothing to really... I mean, I guess Megadalone... Whatever, uh, this is the first thing to get Repel Dark, and it's not like I'm really going to be using Metatron anyways. Uh, if you want to get Igus' ultimate weapon, you would just go ahead and use Metatron, and you'd get the gun. But we're not taking her into the final battle, so I don't really care about getting her that. Oh, look at that. Huge fusion. What do you hold in yourself, Metatron? You know, I just realized I probably have to make... Oh, no. Okay, I'm good. Uh, hold that thought. So, yeah, Mega Delone going to be the first one. I'm um, Just because uh, I'm still going to, like, keep this compendium in check here. If anyone... If he gets any level or like, anything to, um... Which we call it? Get, uh... If any skill tries to change, I'm saving. Come oh, on, Repel Ice. Nice. So, Fear doesn't scare me as much as Charm does, so... Yeah. Come well, on, Repel alike, huh? I mean, that's that's pretty good. I mean, honestly, I, I, I don't use Light Skill so much anyways. I have someone who has a better one. Uh, repel Fires next, huh? So cool, there's that. And now, yeah, the next one is Orpheus Telos. I need to make sure I have everything. I'm not going to make you watch me go, like, grab everyone, but we need Messiah, Hillel, Metatron, which I have the three of those, Chiyu, Asura, and Thanatos. Oh, it just crashed here. How interesting. Okay, so... My game crashed again, which you saw. 
Uh, so I've just been doing the slow fuse anything save game, the, the, the classic. Alright, so this is a hexagon spread. Yeah, Orpheus, Orpheus Telos requires Xanatos, Asura, Chiyu, Metatron, Hillel, and Messiah. So he will uh, just kind of grab whatever. Let's see. Is this... So we have double auto, <laughs> Morning Star, Tempest Slash. I think's maybe fine. I'm trying, I'm trying to think of like what else, uh, like what I actually just put on here. Because the only thing he learns is Victory Cry. Well, uh, I guess it really doesn't matter. But the thing is that he is uh, literally strong against everything. Uh, so I guess I may want to like be think of this a little well. So see, Repel Ice, Enduring Souls, Nice, Akash Arts, Moragadine, Repel Dark. Like I really don't care about. Mamudo. I, mean, I have a fire spell, and I have a strike spell. I, I'm I'm not gonna try to fuck with it anymore. So this this may be uh it gives us the 97. I can't remember how many levels you actually get when you fuse later. I should like actually know this, but I don't. I just keep hit mashing the button. Also, I just want to let it be known that I don't know how far this video is, but I've been recording for 22 minutes. <laughs> Yes. Orpheus, master of strings. See, so, uh, in Persona 3 Portable, it's kind of hilarious because, like, you just have so many Orpheuses because you have the male version and the female version. So, whatever. Let me just mash through this. Okay, so we're definitely not getting Victory Cry now, right? Yeah, no. We won't be getting Victory Cry then. Because it's not like I'm taking this guy into freaking. Monad. I just saved the Armageddon's painting for that one. Speaking of, though, I do need to uh, kind of reassemble my team. So, let me just replace the record. So, I'm going to go get my team in order, and then I will showcase the last fusion spell. So, we're just going to come in here real quick, and... Uh, oh, yeah, I guess there, there is this request. It's just to get a weapon from Monad. It's not worth doing. <laughs> it, the gold chests are so few and far between there that it's just it makes you want to gouge many eyes out. So anyways, yes, last judge will need Mithra and the greatest of the heaven heavenly law, heavenly host. Which in that case is Metatron. So I guess let me just get the boy equipped. And then uh well, let me do my safety save as I always do, and then let's go bully some low-level Tartar enemy for the last time. Oh, you are so unlucky. So with Minotron and Mithra's power, you're able to use Last Judge. Last Judge deals severe almighty damage to all foes. Say goodnight. Man, that was loud. It sucks. Oh man, I definitely need a pixie in my party. What would I do without a pixie, man? Whatever. Man, I got two experienced Metatron. Better be happy about that. Anyways, let's uh, just get out of here. So there are a few things that I'm going to do before leaving. Uh, one of which, well, I'll just do that right now. Uh, we do have to turn in these requests, even though it's just going to give us outfits. This game really would have benefited from having an outfit slot, kind of like future games did. Well, I, Persona 4 Golden, I think, it had the outfit slot. And then 5 and 5 Royal had one as well. So, yes. Yeah, I did Last Judge. A fierce blow with a gigantic hammer. Is this how the judges in your world dispense justice with their gavels? Uh, yes, actually. See, so yeah, we got Akihiko's winter outfit. And, well, we may as well just accept the... The last few that we uh, need to do. Fuck the Jack Frost dolls. Oh, I never did this one. Oh well. Not the gloves would be good for me, anyways. So, Trickster. Yep, I did that one. Did the one on the boss. <laughs> the Jack in the Box that Loki and Susano made. What could be inside? <laughs> what a great question. So, we have Mitsuru's winter outfit. And well, I don't even know who the last person is we need a winter outfit for. Oh, I did this one, right? Uh, winter outfit for Ken. I sometimes forget Ken exists. Before the world was created and until the very end, Vishnu slept on Anada's back. Must have been very comfortable lying on those scales. Yeah, maybe. 
I think we have some differing opinions on what comfortable is. Ardenari. So damn, I was like really behind on these, huh? The fire is so strong that it reduces everything to cinders. This could be a disaster in the kitchen, so don't get carried away. I th I, okay, so I'm playing Stranger of Paradise, and uh, I, I just uh, got the fire crystal. And I find it hilarious how, like, I, I, I don't know if this is ever mentioned in any other Final Fantasy game, but, like, I was talking to some random people in town, and they're like, Oh, you know, I, I've been burning all my food now. Everything's so much hotter. And someone's like, Oh, I was taking a bath, and I had to get out because the water was really hot. I just find that hilarious. I had no idea that the crystals did that. J.O. Crystals. Armageddon, I have done this a lot. The ultimate power of Armageddon. Please be very careful when using this. Nope. <laughs> so you should check out Boadad. That's probably cracked in half. Yes, we received a Plume of Dusk. Uh, which, if you were to play the game on easy mode, I think it gives you 10 Plumes of Dusk, which just allows you to, like, either revive or restart the battle or whatever. So we, we can get one restart now. <laughs> So I think I'm just about done in here. I mean, I guess I gotta, I gotta get rid of the other Anada, stupid low-level persona, and just get someone else to round out my crew. Uh, but before I leave, I'm just going to equip my final party with their ultimate weapons, and then, well, I'll just see you tomorrow. So here we are, end of class, and well, there's nothing we can do today. Now, I normally would have just skipped, but there is something very important that we can do tonight. And I guess as I'm going home and going the long way intentionally, uh, at this point, like I said, with me being level 99, everything, uh, like we're, we were over leveled for the final fight by the time we were level 80. Because all the final bosses are like level 75. Or like, rather, that's kind of around the level they're at is mid 70s. Uh, so I really don't expect much trouble with that. Uh, especially because, well, I'm getting ahead of myself now. Uh, but yeah, so basically, you could technically, um, reduce the level of your equipment and all that fun stuff if you wanted, uh, just to kind of make it easier and, like, have, like, different personas that aren't super overleveled, but... Welcome back. Screw that. Yeah. Oh, I'm feeling great. I'll rest tomorrow. Yep, spring will be here very soon. So if we go over to Koromaru tonight, he arfs at us, and he's looking at us pleadingly. He seems to want to go for a walk. He's begging you more than usual tonight. Would you like to go for a walk with everyone? Yeah. So yes, the last walk we can do in this game is a walk with the entire group. <laughs> like Aki goes so nervous. Like how Fuku's just like, in the jungle gym prison. It's Siri and Yukari are hanging out talking. <laughs> I guess now just hanging out with the dog. The day of the final battle draws near. Everyone is having fun, as if trying to make the most of this moment. He spent a pleasant evening with them. I kind of wish there was some dialogue there, but uh, oh well. But yeah, so that's a really fun, like, last walk you can get. Um, there is one thing I want to showcase, though, before we get to the final day. So, I'm, I'm saying that to remind myself. And hey, look at that, it's the 30th, and I'm sure there's, yeah, nothing going on. But yeah, I guess I, I should mention, it's kind of like, I mentioned how tight the schedule is in this game for Max and Social Links. We maxed out Argus on the 28th. That leaves four, like, yeah, four, well, I guess three days. Like, like that's it. That's it. We have three days after all of that. Now, we could have maybe done a bit more in the summer with, you know, stuff like Nozomi or the Hierophant. Just because, you know, we were just watching movies every day in, well, I guess in August or whatever. Which is kind of a whatever. But yeah, I mean, like I said, very tight schedule. Greetings. Hello, I guess. Tomorrow, the promised day. It's been ten years since death has awakened. Once we enter Tartarus tomorrow, we won't be able to leave. Oh, I'm I'm very ready. I'm so ready, in fact, I'm going to bed.
Today is the promised day. At last, you can confront Nyx at the top of Tartarus. You suspect that once you enter Tartarus tonight, you won't be able to leave until the battle is over. Yes, I know I've mentioned it before, but um, if you were to not start Tanaka's social link, if you got to the point where like you were, like you were giving him his last bit of money before he's like, are you an idiot? You could literally skip the entire night. Yeah, everyone's gone today. No one's here hanging out. Uh, but yeah, so if you didn't start to knock a social link, you can literally skip this entire thing and still get the true ending. Uh, very based. Uh, I, I feel like there's something else I was going to mention, but I don't remember. Anyways, let's gear up for our final delve into Tartarus. All right. This will probably be the last time we meet like this. Is everyone ready? Um, can I say something? I know that we have to defeat Nyx. But if you think about it, that means we'll be getting rid of the Dark Hour. So our memories may disappear. But even if that happens, I want you all to know, I won't forget you. Even if it robs us of all of our memories together, I will still remember you all. <laughs> we know you will, Yucatan. I won't forget you either. Neither will I. I will not forget you, Yukari-san. Don't worry. Even if you do forget about us, I'll remind you. Yeah, so don't worry about it. Oh, <laughs> I'm so glad to hear that. Okay. Then after the battle, no matter what happens, let's promise to meet each other again. Good idea, but where should we meet? I don't think it should be the dorm. We'll come back here anyways if all goes well. Hey, shouldn't we also decide on when we'll meet? Yeah, it should be a special day. What about graduation day? When the dark hour vanishes, our memories might not disappear right away. So we shouldn't plan to meet too soon after the battle. And there's no day that will have more significance to us all. Wow! You're really smart, Yukari-san. Graduation day. Yes, that will be easy to remember. Yeah, that's probably our best bet. Graduation day it is. Now. Where should we meet? It should be somewhere where it's easy to recognize that peace has returned to the city. And when we meet again, we should remember how we're feeling right now. That no matter what may happen, we will never look back. I agree. <laughs> Sorry, but you'll just have to wait. All right then, let's get going. Let's do this like always. Yeah. Together. I will do my best. Good, because I'm counting on you. This is going to be easy. Yes, it is. All right, so a little last uh, meet up here. Let's see, can I put people in my party right now? Yes, he did. And we're gonna fucking make that baton the shiniest. Absolutely. Junpei? Absolutely, dude. Love the enthusiasm. Koro. Five check. Bark, bark. Good, good. Akihiko. That it does. Yes, he will. Mitsuru. Uh. <clears throat> Mitsuru. <laughs> this is true. 
Uh, not yet. Yeah, I should have talked to her last. So let's just get everyone else's uh, personal vibe check in a 1 to 10, I guess. All right, love to hear it. Fuka. Ugh, oh, goddammit, I keep just turning it at the last second. Yeah, I don't want that to happen either. Where's Ken at? Oh, there he is. Absolutely. Okay. So, Mitsu, I am ready to go now. Let's do it. Yes, no turning back. Yep. As it keeps telling us, once we enter Tartarus, we can't leave. So, I'm ready. And for the final time, we enter the Dark Hour. Okay, well, let's assemble our final team. Akihiko. Junpei. And Yukari. Now, I guess is also an extremely valid uh, person to bring, just because she also can buff, but uh, I like Yukari's spunk and healing. <laughs> uh, another thing I should mention is that uh, to round out my party, I did bring uh, Vishnu and Anata. So just in case I really need to like recover, I can I can make us invincible for a minute. So yeah, here we are back on floor 252, and let us go up the stairs. So no shadow should ever want anything to do with us because well, we're just too powerful. Everyone's level 99. Do I have Satan equipped? Good. Uh, and it's mostly because it doesn't matter anyways. The the next few fights here are so easy that I may as well just end it for them. And plus, it'll be funny and worth it. Trust me. Oh, we're scanning up on the floors. How many floors are we going to go up, Fuka? On the 258th floor? Buh -huh, but what? It's not a shadow. It's Shrega. Oh, man. So see how everyone is maxed out now? We can just go ahead and open up the field menu, and then, um... Let's see, is, is that gonna... Is that gonna... Oh, I should've just read what she was gonna say. Uh, we'll do this. Please try okay, so now that we do that, we just open the field menu again, and we have everyone split up. Please spread out and uh, search the area. Please run around. So they will go ahead and disperse, and they will... They'll grab any something. items that are on the floor. I mean, we, we learned about this at the start of the game, of course. Uh, but yeah, so Junpei found the stairs, and we're gonna move on. And so before we leave, they'll give us anything that we got. Or anything that they got, rather. Except for, I think it was the money that Junpei didn't give. So yeah, only one member of Strega on the 258th. Uh, can I just, like, find this place? I mean, literally splitting up is still just the best option. It just sucks that the mod menu uh, makes it have to take additional press. Spread out and search the area. Sorry, so there's the access point, so hopefully no one comes over here. Or hopefully if they do, they're not going to tell me if they found the access point because I already found it. So Junpei, it's really just up to you to find the, the stairs, my dude. Sweet. Found something. So yeah, thankfully in Portable, when I just have everyone like maxed out almost immediately, it'll be uh, very nice just to be able to rut, like blast through Tartarus. Of course, I'm getting ahead of myself. Yeah, so the next floor, we have a guy from Strega. I bet he's going to rue the day that... Uh, he decided to stay on the 258th floor. Oh, cool. I found the stairs. Nice. Let's go. So, well, he's, he's not here. Lying to me. So, yeah, we can go back down to the first floor if we, if we need to heal or save or anything. Well, let's just uh, walk on up. Oh, I'm very ready. You came after all. You? Where's your partner? Takaya went on ahead of me. He's destined for greater things. So, it looks like you're serious about fighting Nyx. How do you know about Nyx? I pieced together the information Ikutsuki left behind. But not all of it made sense. He was a real nut job. Did you know Ikutsuki? 
we were surprised to find out he was your boss. We really only knew his name. He was just one of the researchers who created us. He created you? Who are you? <laughs> There's no use in telling you. The end is near. We don't have time for this. Get out of our way. Can't do that, little lady. There's no way you'll be able to stop Nyx. But I can't let you interfere with Takaya's wish. Do you even understand what you're saying? If Nyx isn't stopped, all life will be destroyed. Exactly. We won't live much longer, and we want to see the end before we die. That is Takaya's wish, so I'm not backing down. Enough talk. Let's do this. This is it. I ain't holding back. Now, he's mostly not lying, uh, but he mostly is. Because it's, it's he's like a very previously up like a very upgraded Jin from the last fight. Uh, however, he has low defense because nerds are fragile, uh, and also because I can just do this. Like I said, it would be a one one round deal no matter what I did because I'd either thunder rain him or do this. See you, dude. Now, if I did let him win, I don't know if it's on the Ed and Portable, but seeing how we are all wearing the armor of light, uh, he will mention something about like, oh, why are you covering up your weaknesses? What are you, scared? But he doesn't get to say anything because he just died. What are you waiting for? Finish me off! I would do anything for Takaya. Why are you so loyal to him? <laughs> he wouldn't understand. Takaya showed me the light when I was in the darkness. It was a long time ago. In order to better understand the dark hour, Karijo rounded up kids that were living on the streets and gave them special powers so they could investigate Tartarus. What? But when that power doesn't emerge naturally, it's difficult to control. So the kids had to take experimental medication so their powers wouldn't kill them. Only three kids out of the original hundred survived. And after six months, the experiment was canceled. Then, those three were... You all suffered at the hands of Karijo. Takaya saved me from it all. He said, don't let the past control you, and don't look to the future. Simply live in the moment. To be honest, I don't even care about Kirijo anymore. But, Takaya's wish must be fulfilled. You. We were here too long. We're running out of time. We have to go now. But we can't. You idiots. I don't want your pity. let you eat me. I believe in you, Takaya. Fulfill your wish. I will hold on to the freedom you gave me to the very end. Hey, was that... Did he... 
Let's go. Oh, so now it's a frag grenade. Last time it was just a smoke grenade. They don't look the same, I can tell you that. I've played a lot of video games. So yeah, uh, even within like the last, I don't know, like two hours of this game, we're still getting lore dump that Carijo literally rounded up kids and uh, experimented on them. That's great. We'll touch more on that later. So what, what do we got, Fuka? 262nd floor? Well, okay, we gotta go a few floors, so let's just do what we've been doing, split up and uh, try. Oh, Please stairs are right here. Let's go. Nice. I love when the stairs are just right there. Oh, I'm hanging in there. Don't you worry about me. And uh, yeah, don't worry. I'm not just gonna sit there and arm again, like the final boss. Uh, at least for 99% of it. It'll make sense later. All right. Right, the guy's on the next floor, and the stairs are right here. God, I love it. Why couldn't the stairs be this nice to me when I was going to fight Jin? All right, well, we have our team here. Let's just go. Is the top of Tartarus past here? Indeed. Then let us through. I am not standing in your way. I take it you have defeated Jin. You are quite troublesome. What is it that you seek? These are your final moments. The end is nigh. Sorry, but we're not going to let that happen. You are merely wasting your energy. Why not celebrate this wonderful moment? What better way could you spend your final moments together? Will you shut up already? My life was stolen from me. And in its place, I was given a power I never asked for. And so, I learned that the future is only a delusion. Only by striving to live every moment to its fullest can the soul truly be satisfied. That is why we welcome this glorious revelation. To shine a light upon this darkened world. You're so full of shit! I'm not dying so you can have a friggin' nightlight! <laughs> this is not merely my desire. There are many who have also gathered to rejoice in her arrival. That's just because all these weird things have been happening. That is untrue. Who is responsible for reviving Nyx? Can a single person boast of this great accomplishment? You all work tirelessly to prevent it, and yet in doing so, you unwittingly aided in her coming. So you see, this is not just my will. It is the will of all people. Man cannot face death without first finding meaning in life. But the world has realized that any meaning in life was lost long ago. Nyx has come because humanity has cried out for her salvation. That can't be. I... I don't believe you. And yet, there is truth in what he says. I guess. But now we know that it was a mistake. And that's why we're here. It's not a matter of whether it is possible or not. It's a matter of believing in ourselves. That's what it means to live. The world isn't so simple that one person can decide whether we all live or we all die. So even if there is no hope, we won't give up. <laughs> huh. 
what do you know of this world? No matter how long you search, or how hard you pray, eventually you will realize that there is no truth. Just as death is eternal, a truth that has been lost can never be found again. Are you really so desperate to die that you will stand before the almighty Nyx? Such foolishness is what I am trying to rid this world of. If you insist on asserting your way of living, then I shall do the same. The coming of Nyx is but moments away. <laughs> <laughs> you needn't hurry. The moment we await is predestined. It's only a matter of time. Please be careful. I sense even greater power than before. So yeah, in this case, uh, Takaya has the third rank of single target spells, so from, like, you know, Garula to Garudine, and he also has both Megadola and Megadolone. Uh, I really like the background here. Uh, it reminds me when I dusted on my computer the other day, and uh, I live in a, a dust pool, I guess, and uh, it looked really cool in my room with the sunlight shining through. Anyways, uh, see you later, dude. Yeah, that just happened. What just changed? Oh, Vishnu leveled up. <laughs> Come on, you're killing the vibes, dude. So it Akasha Arts to all foes. This is severe strike damage to one foe. Do I even have... Uh, Hama boost is hilarious. Get, get out of here, please. The son's about to have the skill Bufudine. I mean, I have someone with that. What's, what are you gonna change to? Null strike? Actually, hey, that's not terrible. I can't believe that. I have failed, haven't I? There is nothing more I can do. Now, kill me. Are you scared? <laughs> what a peculiar question. You know nothing of death if you think that it is something to fear. What do you mean? You fear it because you do not understand it. I will not explain to you any further. There's no honor in taking the life of someone who can't move. You will live to see if what you wished for comes true or not. Yeah. Lie there and repent for what you've done. <laughs> you are all so odd. Takaya slowly closed his eyes. They're still open over there. We're finally here. Up ahead is the top of Tartarus. The promised place Ryoji spoke of. Let's regroup for the final battle. So, Jin and Takaya were pushovers, but can we defeat Nyx? Find out next time in the finale of Persona 3 FES. I got a good feeling about this one. Okay, so uh, I'm just throwing this in here after the fight with Jin and Takaya. So, something that I, I found out uh, while using this mod menu, as I accidentally clicked on this. Uh, so, something that's really hilarious is that we can fast travel around a to to everywhere so yeah if we go to the the mall here <laughs> well it looks like it did back in the full moon operation but everyone's here the great man uh shut up so, yeah uh it, it's just funny stuff like we can literally go around and uh, check out the town everywhere that has a, a dark hour 
alternative is going to look like this. So if we go to like the Iwatodai uh, station over here, we, we, we take our little train there. So, yeah, you know, she's just chilling over there like nothing's going on. <laughs> we can cross the road. And, uh, you know, everything is just chilling. And for some reason, as we cross over here, it, it starts playing this music because I, I'm assuming it's because that you have a moment here where you select your party before crossing over that road. So that's that's kind of funny. Like, you know, she's just selling her fucking takoyaki. Nothing's wrong over here. And then I guess just one last place to show. We, we can go to the school there. Oh, Gekukon High. Oh, the gate's closed. It's Sunday. Uh, you can, like, as you can see, like, the, the trees are kind of weird due to the fog. But, like, the school is totally normal, so I don't know what all this hubbub is about, uh, any Tartarus. I think it's a lie. Anyways, see you guys next time for the finale.